up YouTube? Um, just checking in, say hey, wanna show you guys what I'm starting to work on, rocking out to some good music. Actually working on a new farrowing hut for my, my guilt. Her first litter is due in about six days. So tons of other projects on the farm here, but I gotta work on getting this thing done. And better give you guys a quick rundown before I get a little further so you can see where I start. So what I've got going on right now, hopefully that's not too bright, but right now I've got skids on the ground. I've got four by four treated lumber. It's gonna be eight foot wide, 12 foot long. And then right now you'll see these, these uh, two by fours, if I can get my hand right, that are down here and then connecting into a two by six that's gonna run along basically the face of the roof and the butt of the roof on the back side. And then I got the two by four here running along the side. That's 16 foot. And that way I can get a nice awning going over the front and a little bit coming off the back so I can at least keep some of that water off um, going front to back. And I use treated lumber on at least the main frame that way, any water that might roll or get under won't necessarily get in contact with my plain lumber, so that way it doesn't rot uh, near as quick. But I've got my stash of stud length two by fours that I'm gonna be putting across the treated wood for the base of my roof. And then I've got the hook up here, and I've got some OSB that I'm gonna put as the initial decking on that roof as well as the walls, the back. And then, uh, sorry if it's too loud with the music. And then you can kind of see some of it sticking out of the barn there. And then I've got, whoop, I've got these right here. Got them for a steal, like 25 cents a foot, which is crazy, but this guy just wanted to get rid of it. I figured it was gonna be trash, but it's good stuff. There's hardly any holes and it's not really rusted so like new saving a bunch of money um, but that's the key get it done cheap as possible make it work just get it to happen so that's what i'm working on right now um, i'll show you guys once i get the walls up and uh at least framed out i'm gonna just do regular studs uh, my pitch uh it might be a, a, a two uh, I'm, I'm debating on a four i don't really need it to be super steep um, and honestly, it's just easier to cut and, uh, I don't really need to move water fast. Um, and it's a low structure. I don't care about the snow load. So, you know, a two would be strong enough for what I've got going and gives it a little bit lower of a profile as well for the crazy winds we've got out here in Kansas. So, but I'll show you guys the spa while I'm at it, uh, for what we're working on. So this is what I, what I did for just a quick down and dirty little shelter because we were using this old dog house until they got too big and then I threw this thing together with just some two by fours two by sixes and some sheets of OSB and uh, it gets the job done for now but you can see our uh, our guilt right there looking good enjoying her spa treatment and then her little boyfriend right here named Pua Make sure you guys can see him, but yeah, he's a uh, he's loving it. This is their nice little nice little mud area, and I've also got him in a new run that I'm going to move him out of this because this used to be a dog run until my dog passed away. So got a couple pigs making it happen out here, but hope you hope you guys enjoy this video. But be uh, be looking out for more. Excited to share this with you guys. See you later.